Hi guys, so this is like my fourth attempt at filming this video. The dog ran in, knocked over my tripod. I'm in a different spot, I have it on a tripod. I'm trying to get lighting to be a little bit more easy on you guys. And then my little one walked in and just decided to start having a conversation and he needed me, so I had to take care of him. So I'm gonna try this again. I'm gonna try this again. I have a small, <laughs> I have a Dollar Tree um, and a teeny tiny Walmart haul. I went to Walmart to pick up some prescriptions and while I was in the actual pharmacy department, I um, I found these things. So I'm gonna go with the Walmart. I'm frazzled because of the chaos that has been happening. Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> so I found these socks. These are aloe infused socks. And they were, I think they were like $2.87 at Walmart. Stop scratching. Stop, itchy. Itchy girl. You see her? She's super itchy with, I don't know what it is. She's super sensitive to, I think, like the seasons and pollen and stuff. And she goes outside and her little paws get red. And anyway, if you hear noise, it's either the dog or the laundry because it's laundry day and everything's pulled out or you hear the little one. So I apologize for the background chaos, but that's what's happening in my life right now. Back to the socks. So I like these. My daughter has super, super dry hands and we found the gloves for her at Kohl's and I hadn't seen them anywhere else but Kohl's. Uh, so for eczema and things like that, I like to give these to her and I like them too for my feet just to moisturize and they just feel so soft even just here in the package like this. So for $2.87 or $2.97 or whatever they were, not a bad price. So I picked those up and then I also just picked up um, toothbrushes because we've had a rampage of toothbrushes falling in the toilet bowl in our house and I don't know what's happening but I have backup toothbrushes now. Um, I, I don't even know. Kids are screwing around while they're brushing their teeth and the to toothbrushes fall in the toilet and that's just disgusting. So back to now we're going to go to the Dollar Tree. So when I first filmed it, it was actually really cute and I have to, I had to refilm it. I got the dog some traits. These ones here. These are called people, people crackers. Now my dog is not picky. She loves all treats. She loves her bones. She knows when I come home with the bag that there's usually bones and treats in here for her. Let's see if I can get her to come back. Suki, come here. Treats. But when I gave these to her, she was like, not even going to happen. These are disgusting. Come here. <gasps> well, you got a toy? Do you want a treat? Do you want a treat? You want it? Yeah, see? She won't even take it. Are they nasty? You don't like them? Yeah. She never puts her nose up to treats. So these are probably, I don't know, if you have a picky dog, maybe not get these ones. No? No. All right. Not Suki approved. Okay. So we're going to, I can't even remember because I'm so frazzled. Like I have a pile here and I had it all in the bag. So I'm just, if I repeat, show you something, I apologize. Found this soap. This was in somebody else's video. Actually, I think like two other people. And this particular soap doesn't have any um, animal fat, animal byproducts, harmful chemicals, or excessive artificial fragrance. And I like that. So this is an oatmeal verbena. It smells amazing. And they only had this one that was sealed and one that was open that had like gouges in it. So I left that one there. So yeah, and I went to, we have three stores in our neighborhood. One I won't even attempt going to because it's just awful. And so the other two, just this, just that one. I found Little Man, this little cup here, Star Wars, he loves. It's a good size, it's plastic. I needed a new, um, well, I didn't need it, I mean, need, but I wanted a new compact mirror for my purse because I have the same one I've had forever and it's really big from Sephora. So this is a small one. I love you. I thought that was cute. I found this book, um, The Childhood of Jesus. Ghost Hunt 2. This is written by, um, not Ghost Adventures guy, the Ghost Hunter guys. I need a sip of my smoothie. Mm. Okay. 
These my husband loves. We usually get them in the grocery store and the Dollar Tree had them. So he threw two in the cart. Hopefully they're delicious. I hope. I already did the soap. What else did I do? Did I do this? Guys, I'm so sorry if I'm repeating myself. It's just a glass bottle. It's got a cute little straw. And I love this color. This and coral coral are like my favorite colors right now. So I'm just going to put my water in this. And it's nice. I like it. Those who didn't like. Okay. This is by LA Colors. And I don't have a ton of experience with LA Colors. And I've definitely not tried this. But this is a lip color and balm in one. And it's in the color Wham. And it looks just like a corally coral color. I'm going to try that. Uh, who's this? I don't even know what brand this is. It just says Nail Art. No, it's Revlon. I have tried this. This is Moon Candy. I have a purple one with glitter. This is a black with glitter. So I just, I like, 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 like that. And for a dollar, I think I paid like $7 for mine at Rite Aid. So pick that up. This is another LA Colors gloss. This is a moisture, a moisture gloss with vitamin E. And it's in the color Just Kissed. It's like a peachy metallic. It's got some, it's got some little goldy sparkles in there. We'll see how that looks. And another LA Colors. This is a moisturizing lip with color and high shine in the color Flushed. And it's a combo. There's lipstick and gloss. So I picked those up. Did I show these? I can't remember. Ugh. For the trash can, linen closet, closets. I pick up a few of these. They smell really good. This one's the sparkling citrus. And it's, it says it's for small spaces. So some of that. Just some wipes. I put my Mary Kay um, makeup remover on it. I got three of these for me and the girls. We like this product. We've used it before. So it's cocoa butter lip balm. Some whitening strips. I have never seen these at the Dollar Tree before. I don't know if they work. So if you've used them, let me know in the comments below, but a dollar. I went looking for this case, uh, or one of the things I was looking for, it's a makeup case, <clears throat> a nice size one that was pretty deep. I've seen some other people haul it. They had one there in a horrible, ugly pattern that I didn't want any part of, but I saw this pouch and it's in a really pretty Tiffany blue with polka dots and I love polka dots and I love the color. So I thought that would be good for the purse because it's small. What else? Superman band-aids. <clears throat> this stuff I go through like water, just eye drops. Then we bought, we have a hummingbird feeder that we purchased. And at the time, my husband, my legs are, this is, <laughs> I'm a hot mess today, guys. Like if, if you like hot mess. I don't know. I'm such a hot mess right now. <sighs> hummingbird feeders. I was told by somebody that you don't want to use the red nectar, that it, it makes that so they won't feed in nature anymore. And I didn't want to do that. So we didn't buy the nectar there. And I was just going to make my own at home. And then when we were at the Dollar Tree, they also have hummingbird feeders there now if you're, if you're interested. And next to it, they had this nectar. And um, it says it doesn't have any artificial preservatives or color. So... Um, let's see. Yeah, it just, it doesn't say anything about this one being better than the red one. I don't know. We're going to try it and see. What else do I have here? Okay. My husband picked up some of this grill stuff for his barbecue. That's a pretty, that's a pretty decent size for a dollar. And then I had some oven cleaner. Terribly fun, but good price. This I found, I love yellow, and it's just a scrubber for the shower. So I picked that up. There's uh, apparently somebody got into the candy. Some elves that live in my house. Some Reese's. There's also a pack of Snickers Almond, same size, and some Kit Kat, which are missing. These are mine. I love them. I just love them. So I got some Swedish, Swedish fish. Okay. So one of the things that I went for <clears throat> is I had seen a few people hauling the makeup brushes from, um, 
wet and wild. Yes, wet and wild. So I can always use makeup brushes. I mean, and these are cute ones. They're white and pink. And I thought, okay, I'm going to go there. Mine did not have it. I was looking at, they had the contour one. They had a blush one. They had really nice brushes. And the only one that mine had were these ones. So I thought I bought, well, did I do that or did I not do that? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I did. Okay. So this is a large eyeshadow brush, cruelty free, gluten free, and vegan for a dollar. And it's pink. I don't know if you can see that because there's a glare, pink. And then a small one looks identical. Same thing vegan, cruelty, and gluten free. So I bought those, two and two. And then they had this one, which just says it's an eyeshadow brush and in your shadow eyeshadow brush but this is just a black one so i picked up those got those this is a auto eyeliner uh yeah auto eyeliner no sharpener needed in black brown i just wanted a simple pencil i don't know how la colors works but i thought i'd give it a shot some ponies a bone for miss suki the Kit Kats that aren't opened. Then I found these, and this is Skin Milk Bath Vanilla Scent. I've never seen these there before. To my knowledge, I don't think I've seen anybody haul them. Um, let's see what this says. The luxurious Skin Milk Cleansing Bar will wrap you in a creamy vanilla scent, skin softening formula to cleanse while nurturing the skin. Gentle enough for all skin types. Then it tells, it has directions. Okay directions and this comes out of El Paso, Texas. So I bought two of them and you can smell the vanilla scent through the wrappers and it smells good. So some soap for my keys, some tape just because I have tape fiends in this house, a sub coconut milk just for cooking for a dollar. I thought that was a really good price. Okay. Then I found these, these little goodies. So this is also through Wet n Wild, I believe. No, I'm sorry. I lied. This is Elf, 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 Elf HD blush, rich pigment color for a soft focus effect. I've never tried these before. Uh, one color is called Encore, which is a really pretty pinky color. And then the other one is called Superstar, which is like a corally pinky color. So I thought I'd give those a try. And then a lip smacker, lip polish with sheer tint and shine. And it's in pink velvet gelato. So that's that. Go inside and play, sweet pea. Okay? I love you. I love you too. Okay. Do you want to come sit over here? Yeah. Come on. Sorry, are you playing with Suki? Yeah. Suki doesn't like the treats that we bought her. Sit down. Come sit over here next to Mama. Okay, good boy. I'm almost done. Okay, and then the last thing is some nail polish. And I thought that they had another color that was this really pretty burgundy with like gold. And um, I guess I, I put it back. I don't know. So that's this color. What tea was it? Dollar Tree. <laughs> what tree was it? And that's it, guys. So um, I hope you liked my crazy flustered Dollar Tree haul. And I hope you guys are having a good day. I'm going to film another video. I did and... buy another cup. Yeah, that's your cup. You like your cup? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to film another video um, Ooh, for some stuff that I found um, at Marshall's and some Mother's Day stuff. I thought that would be fun. So that's it. I hope you guys have a good day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.